On February 16, 1945, in New York City's theater district, Vera Ellen made her debut in Laughing Room only at the Music Box Theater. Unbeknownst to the audience, they were witnessing the rise of a talented dancer who would leave a lasting impression on Hollywood. Vera Ellen's name would become synonymous with grace and agility in dance and film. However, her life remains shrouded in mystery with hidden truths and lesser known facts. This script will delve into the enigmatic world of Vera Ellen and uncover eight facts that shed light on the life of this captivating star. Vera Ellen, born Vera Ellen Westmeyer Rove on February 16, 1921 in Cincinnati, Ohio, displayed a remarkable talent for dance from a young age. By the time she was 10, she had already joined the Hessler Dance Studio, where she honed her skills and began to make a name for herself in local dance competitions. Her natural ability and dedication to her craft would soon set her on a path to stardom in the world of Hollywood musicals. Vera Ellen, born in Norwood, Ohio, made her Broadway debut at the young age of 18 in the musical Very Warm for May in 1939. This marked the beginning of a successful career for the talented performer. Her performance in Very Warm for May was well received and opened doors for her to take on more challenging roles. In 1942, Vera Ellen starred in the Broadway musical by Jupiter, which further solidified her reputation as a skilled and talented actress. The show, which featured music by Richard Rogers and lyrics by Lawrence Hart, was a critical success and ran for over 400 performances. Vera Ellen's performance in By Jupiter was highly praised and she received widespread recognition for her talent and versatility as a performer. Vera Ellen's success on Broadway led to opportunities in Hollywood where she would go on to have a successful film career. But it was on the Broadway stage where she first made her name and established herself as a force to be reckoned with in the world of musical theater. Her early experiences on Broadway shaped her as an artist and laid the foundation for the successful career that was to follow. Vera Ellen's journey in Hollywood took off in the early 1940s. She had already made a name for herself as a talented dancer and actress on Broadway. However, it was her significant role in the 1949 film On the Town that truly marked her ascent in Hollywood. In On the Town, Vera Ellen starred alongside Hollywood legends Gene Kelly and Frank Sinatra. The film was a major success and Vera Ellen's performance was widely praised. Her exceptional dancing skills and undeniable charisma shone through in every scene, cementing her status as a rising star in Hollywood. Prior to On the Town, Vera Ellen had appeared in a few minor film roles. However, it was this role that truly catapulted her into the limelight and solidified her place in Hollywood. Her transition to film was seamless and she quickly became known for her incredible talent and dedication to her craft. Vera Ellen's impact on Hollywood was significant and her legacy continues to be felt today. Her unforgettable performance in On the Town remains a highlight of her career, showcasing her immense talent and versatility as an actress and dancer. Through her work, Vera Ellen left an indelible mark on the world of film, inspiring generations of performers to come. Vera Ellen's career as an actress was marked by her exceptional dance skills, which often took center stage in her films. However, her voice was rarely heard, a decision influenced by the era's cinematic trends and the roles she played. During the 1940s and 1950s, when Vera Ellen was most active in Hollywood, Musical films frequently featured actresses who were skilled dancers, but not necessarily strong singers. The studios often chose to dub the singing parts, emphasizing dance performances instead. In Vera Ellen's case, her roles primarily focused on dancing, and she was frequently paired with talented singers and actors who took on the musical numbers. For instance, in the classic film White Christmas, she shared the screen with legendary singer Rosemary Clooney, who performed most of the movie's songs. Vera Ellen's character, Judy Haynes, was more about showcasing her dance abilities than her vocal prowess. Although Vera Ellen's voice was not often heard in her films, she still made a significant impact on the world of Hollywood musicals. Her captivating dance performances, along with her slender and graceful appearance, made her a beloved figure in the industry. Despite the limited opportunities to showcase her singing abilities, Vera Ellen's legacy as a dancer remains an enduring testament to her talent and dedication. In the end, Vera Ellen's career was defined by her remarkable dance performances, which resonated with audiences and left an indelible mark on cinematic history. Her unique presence on screen, even without frequent singing appearances, served as a reminder that her contributions to the world of entertainment went far beyond her vocal abilities. 
Vera Ellen, born Vera Ellen Westmeyer Rowe, was a significant figure in the Hollywood dance scene. She was instrumental in introducing and popularizing various dance styles, including ballet and jazz in the film industry. Born on February 16, 1921, in Norwood, Ohio, Vera Ellen began her dance training at a young age. She quickly excelled in ballet and tap dance, and by her teenage years, she was already performing with local dance companies. In the early 1940s, Vera Ellen moved to New York City to pursue a career in dance and quickly found success. She appeared in several Broadway productions, including Panama Hattie and By Jupiter. Her exceptional dance skills and charismatic stage presence caught the attention of Hollywood producers, and she soon made her film debut in Words and Music in 1948. Throughout her film career, Vera Ellen played a significant role in popularizing ballet and jazz dance styles in Hollywood musicals. She starred in several classic films, including On the Town, White Christmas, and Call Me Madam. Her dance performances in these films were innovative, energetic, and captivating, leaving a lasting impact on the film industry's dance landscape. Vera Ellen's dance style was unique and distinctive. She combined classical ballet technique with the energy and rhythms of jazz dance, creating a dynamic and engaging performance style. Her dance performances were often the highlight of her films, and she became known for her technical prowess and artistry. Vera Ellen's contributions to the dance world were significant and far-reaching. She inspired countless dancers and performers, and her impact on the film industry's dance landscape is still felt today. Her legacy as a dance pioneer continues to resonate with audiences and dancers alike. In conclusion, Vera Ellen was a trailblazer in the world of dance and film. Her contributions to the popularization of ballet and jazz dance styles in Hollywood musicals were groundbreaking and influential. Her unique dance style and exceptional technical skill left a lasting mark on the dance world, inspiring generations of dancers and performers. Vera Ellen, the talented actress and dancer, faced a number of personal struggles throughout her life. One of her biggest challenges was her battle with anorexia, which began during her time as a Broadway performer and continued throughout her career in Hollywood. Despite her illness, Vera Ellen was known for her incredible dance skills and slender figure, which was often the subject of media attention. In addition to her struggles with anorexia, Vera Ellen also experienced significant personal losses. Her first marriage to Robert Hightower ended in divorce in 1950 after just a few years. The couple did not have any children together. Vera Ellen's second marriage to Victor Rothschild resulted in the birth of a daughter, Victoria, in 1959. However, the couple's happiness was short-lived as Victoria died just a few days after her birth. The loss of her daughter had a profound impact on Vera Ellen, and she became increasingly reclusive in the years that followed. Despite these challenges, Vera Ellen remained dedicated to her craft and continued to work in film and television throughout the 1950s and 1960s. However, her personal struggles took a toll on her health, and she was forced to retire from acting in the late 1960s. Vera Allen passed away in 1981 at the age of 60. While her life was marked by personal struggles, her talent and dedication to her craft left a lasting impact on the world of entertainment. Vera Ellen, a talented actress and dancer, is often the subject of speculation regarding her preference for high neck dresses in her later films. Some believe that she wore these dresses to conceal the effects of anorexia, a condition she was known to have struggled with. Others suggest that she may have been trying to hide the signs of aging, particularly on her neck. This mystery has been a topic of debate among fans and historians for many years. While it is impossible to know for certain why Vera Ellen chose to wear high neck dresses, it is clear that she was conscious of her appearance and took steps to present herself in a certain way. Despite the speculation surrounding her dress choices, there is no denying that Vera Ellen was a highly skilled and accomplished performer. She first rose to fame in the 1940s thanks to her impressive dancing skills and her striking beauty. Over the course of her career, she appeared in a number of successful films, including White Christmas and On the Town. In these films, Vera Ellen's talent and charisma shone through, and she became known as one of the leading actresses and dancers of her time. Despite the challenges she faced, including her struggles with anorexia, she remained a dedicated and hardworking performer, always striving to give her best in every role. Today, Vera Ellen's legacy continues to live on, and she is remembered as a trailblazing figure in the world of entertainment. 
Her performances continue to captivate audiences, and her influence can still be seen in the work of contemporary performers. Despite the mystery surrounding her dress choices, there is no denying the impact that Vera Ellen had on the world of entertainment. She was a truly talented and accomplished performer, and her contributions to the industry will not be forgotten. Vera Ellen's marriages were marked by both love and loss. She first married country music singer and actor Robert Hightower in 1941, when she was just 20 years old. The two shared a passion for the arts and supported each other's careers. However, the strains of fame began to take a toll on their relationship. Hightower, who was not as well known as his wife, struggled with the constant attention and scrutiny that came with being married to a successful actress. Despite these challenges, the couple remained devoted to each other and their daughter, Victoria. But their marriage was ultimately unable to withstand the pressures of the entertainment industry. They divorced in 1950, after nearly a decade together. Vera Ellen's personal life was marked by further tragedy when her daughter Victoria died at the age of 15 in a horseback riding accident. The loss was devastating for the actress, who never fully recovered from the grief of losing her only child. Despite the pain of these experiences, Vera Ellen's marriages and her relationship with her daughter were a significant and meaningful part of her life. Her love for them and the memories she shared with them remained with her always, even as she continued to find success in her career. Vera Ellen, a well-known actress and dancer, made significant contributions to the dance community beyond her achievements on screen. She was a philanthropist and advocate for the dance industry and used her influence to support scholarships and push for higher dance standards in film. Throughout her career, Vera Ellen was dedicated to giving back to the dance community. She was passionate about providing opportunities for aspiring dancers and supported various scholarships to help them achieve their dreams. She believed that everyone should have access to dance education, regardless of their financial situation. In addition to her philanthropic efforts, Vera Ellen also advocated for higher dance standards in film. She believed that dance should be taken seriously as an art form and pushed for more realistic and technically challenging choreography in movies. She worked with directors and choreographers to ensure that the dance sequences in her films were of the highest quality. Vera Ellen's influence on the dance community was significant. Her dedication to supporting scholarships and advocating for higher dance standards helped to elevate the art form and provide opportunities for future generations of dancers. She will always be remembered for her contributions to dance and her unwavering passion for the art. Despite her success in the entertainment industry, Vera Ellen remained humble and dedicated to giving back to the community. She was a role model for aspiring dancers and a trailblazer for women in the industry. Her legacy continues to inspire and influence dancers and filmmakers to this day. In conclusion, Vera Ellen's contributions to the dance community went beyond her on-screen achievements. She was a philanthropist, an advocate who used her influence to support scholarships and push for higher dance standards in film. Her dedication to the art form and her unwavering passion for dance will always be remembered. Vera Ellen, the talented actress and dancer, made her last notable film appearance in Let's Be Happy in 1957. After this, she gradually retreated from public life. This decision came as Hollywood was undergoing significant changes, and Vera Ellen seemed to be focusing more on her personal well-being. Her withdrawal from the spotlight was likely influenced by the evolving entertainment industry, but also by her own health struggles. While she continued to have minor roles in television shows, her public appearances became increasingly rare. Despite her absence from the limelight, Vera Ellen's contributions to the world of cinema and dance remained significant. Her graceful movements and captivating performances had left an indelible mark on her audience, and her films continued to be cherished. However, it's important to remember that like all human beings, Vera Ellen had a life beyond the screen. Her decision to step back from her career suggests that she may have prioritized her personal well-being over her public persona. This is a reminder that the lives of public figures are not just defined by their professional accomplishments, but also by their personal choices and struggles. In the end, Vera Ellen's story is a testament to the complexities of human lives and the various factors that influence the paths we choose. Her legacy continues to resonate, not just in the world of entertainment, but also in the lives of those who were touched by her performances. Vera Ellen was a trailblazing actress and dancer known for her innovative and energetic performances. 
She first gained recognition on Broadway before making the transition to Hollywood, where she starred in a number of popular musical films throughout the 1940s and 1950s. One of the things that set Vera Ellen apart from her peers was her incredible technical skill as a dancer. She was known for her exceptional flexibility, quick footwork, and grace, and she often performed complex routines that left audiences in awe. Despite facing a number of challenges throughout her career, including a battle with an eating disorder and the pressures of the Hollywood spotlight, Vera Ellen remained resilient and dedicated to her craft. She continued to work hard and push herself to be the best dancer she could be, and her determination and perseverance earned her the respect and admiration of her colleagues and fans alike. Today, Vera Ellen's legacy endures through her groundbreaking dance performances and the indelible mark she left on the world of Hollywood and the arts. Her innovative style and unwavering dedication to her craft continue to inspire and influence dancers and performers around the world, and her contributions to the industry will always be remembered. Some of Vera Ellen's most memorable film appearances include On the Town, White Christmas, and Call Me Madam, in which she starred alongside some of the biggest names in Hollywood. Despite her success on the silver screen, Vera Ellen remained humble and dedicated to her craft, always striving to improve and push herself to be the best she could be. In addition to her work in film, Vera Ellen was also an accomplished stage performer, appearing in a number of Broadway productions before making the transition to Hollywood. She was known for her incredible work ethic and her ability to learn and perform complex dance routines with ease, and she quickly became a favorite among producers and directors. Overall, Vera Ellen's legacy is one of innovation, determination, and resilience. She broke barriers and set new standards for dance and performance and her contributions to the world of Hollywood and the arts.